Howdy followers, Jason from Prospecting in the Alpine here, and today I was lucky enough to get invited down to Yakandanda by Sluicebox Carl, and I also got the pleasure of meeting Billy Bunt Prospecting, aka Mick, it was bloody awesome to meet you mate, so I was having a good day before it even started. It looks really nice down here. Lots of nice big to medium sized rocks, which are pretty hard packed when you're trying to dig them out of the ground or yabby pump. Check it out, nice it looks along here. And then as you look just up here, you start seeing a lot of the heavies, like all the way through the water there. I did end up putting in my little river sluice for the day, but for some reason I just couldn't get the flow right. No matter what I did, I just couldn't get it to go. I even moved it three or four times, but I couldn't get it, so I give up in the end. So I ended up just filling my little 10 litre bucket and panning for the rest of the day. Always remember to check a classifier, guys. As you can see, just here I found a nice piece of quartz. It had some nice staining all the way through it. I really do need to thank Carl for this footage. Didn't know he was filming me for half the day, and thank God he did, because my little GoPro ended up dying and I couldn't use any of it. Please remember to hit like and subscribe to see further videos. These are my cons from today, guys. And apparently the area we're digging today is full of ironstone. So I've got the magnet out. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah. Turns out they weren't wrong. I did end up going back the next day to take the dog for a walk and do a few little test pans up further from where we were. We didn't really find anything. So I've got a little bit of learning to do on this particular creek. And the dirt here is nothing like I've ever panned before. There's just so much ironstone which makes it so hard to pan. When you've never seen anything like it down the creek before. It was a really good experience though, trying to learn how to pan it. All the different types of materials in there. This is what I ended up with for 1.1 days, not too bad at all.